Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for May 5th, 2020. We have another card that came from the weekly. Look at that. I swear I shuffled these. <laughs> I really did. So this is the Saint Sinner card and this was talking uh, quite a bit about, you know, kind of getting conflicted with our spirituality. So some of us might be even questioning our beliefs. And you see here, there's, there's a focus here on the third eye and there are tears going on here. And this is maybe realizing the shortcomings of our belief systems, um, realizing that we tried so hard to put our energy behind being good and um, to figuring out life, to figuring out what is the right interpretation of God's source creator, because everybody argues about that. And this is realizing yeah, this is mourning that. Yeah, this is realizing, okay, we were all wrong and yet we were all a little right. And now what? What do we do without division? What do we do when we don't have someone to compete with? What do we do when we don't have someone to argue with? Who are we then? Where do we focus our energy? So this push-pull, this internal conflict, this is something that needs to be looked at today and definitely needs to be given some consideration. And definitely, again, the word is processing. You wanna process through things that are coming up for you, whether that's guilt, shame, where's that coming from? Um, do I need to make amends with someone? Are you having some very deep epiphanies, deep realizations, you know, those kinds of things. Let all that come up to the surface and give yourself a little space. Yeah, because I think there's like a cleansing energy that will be occurring here as indicated by the tears. There's like an emotional cleansing so that you can keep carrying on. And remember, I'm gonna put this little PSA out there for everybody who's listening. If you're using your spirituality so that you seem special, world isn't gonna support you anymore. There will just be nothing there for you to latch on to. Um, and that's a very, very egotistical thing to do. And that would come down to people going, I work with this angel, I channel this, I do that, you know, and they're all coming from, if they are coming from an ego space and you see that, don't play into it, okay? <laughs> don't play into it because I get people writing to me all the time and they're like, well, this person says that this archangel does this, this, and this. What do you say about that? Listen to your own instincts about who is showing up in your world what they're telling you, feel it out for yourself. Does it feel right? Does it resonate with, uh, you know, some, when we say resonate, what that means is like something clicks within you. It's not an ego thing, okay? Oh, it resonates because it's what I want to hear. That's not true. Resonate means everything just kind of fell into that I'm coming home feeling. Everything just kind of clicked into that peaceful feeling. And that's when you know you're in the flow. That's when you know that you are in alignment, okay, with what you need to know now. So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you so much love and take care. Bye-bye.